side. Three. He got it! I think that what impressed me about Gorgie the most was uh, his demeanor. You know, like he would be doing all these great things in the game and drop all these numbers, and, and he acted like he had been there before. Now, Gorgie Jang, that's what he can do. Nice block by Jang. Punched it out of there. A shot spiked downward by Gorgie Jang. What a block by G. Took off of the shot. Oh, it's blocked by Jang. Jang protecting the rim. He is a very respectful young man. He's a very engaging young man. But I, I think it, it really uh, exceeded my expectations. He was so raw in college, but what you did see from Gorgie in college was tremendous shot blocking and his ability to, I think, make great decisions from the elbow uh, and passing the basketball. So I thought he'd fit in well from Rick Edelman's offensive standpoint, but you just never know with post players. I think that when he finally got a chance to play, and I think Rick did a good job of holding him back a bit, giving, you know, getting his feet wet in practice, and then when he finally unleashed Gorgie on the NBA, I think it was pretty evident that Gorgie was ready to take over, and he exceeded my expectations. I thought he was fantastic. I think when you look at his college career, the way he won in college, and how he played, and how he got better, when you look at the way he can play defense, the way his reaction to the ball, the way he can rebound. And he's a much better offensive player than he's given credit for. Uh, he can pass the ball, he, he can make a 15, 16 uh, foot shot. And top of the key jumper, bingo! Oh, what a shot by Gorgie! The jump shot that he hit against Houston, um, you know, having the presence of mind to get that shot up and make it uh, was, was pretty amazing to me. I think he's got a pretty decent a uh, reliable perimeter jump shot, but I think the post-up game is the most important. You know, what he's doing right now, you don't see many rookies coming in and getting a, a you know, 20 and 20 or uh, a double-double like he's doing. And he protects the rib, he's a multiple effort guy, uh, but the most important thing is, are his contributions to win it. Nice pass by Bob Monte, an even better throw down by Gorgie Jang, that got the entire Wolf bench up. You never really got a great feel of what he could do uh, playing with starters, playing in, in you know, the main part of the game. When he finally stopped fouling and he started being able to play the, the game in a real faster, more physical way, he was phenomenal. I, I really believe that had Gorgie been able to get more playing time and get his minutes up earlier, he would have been rookie of the year because I just think that he was, I think he was that good. That is swatted away by Gorgie Jang.